the Porsche race to the WTA final. She is number five. That's an incredible jump for the Greek player. She has improved so much and uh, it's so well deserved. A couple of semifinals in majors. She's just been so consistent. She's been more positive on court. And you see Paula Badoza, she really jumped up to number eight after winning in Indian Wells. We're probably assuming that Barty won't play down in Guadalajara, the same with Naomi Osaka. So now you're going down, uh, down to number 10. These last few players are fighting it out for the reward of playing in Guadalajara. Well, after making history, Maria Sakkari spoke about the feat after her advancing today. After a certain point this season, you know, I started doing really well and I knew I had a chance, so now I'm officially in the finals, so it's, it, it feels great. I'm very proud of myself and my team. All right, and there you see what she has done to have this tremendous breakout year. Semifinals at both Roland Garros and the U.S. Open. The win over Osaka in Miami, 35 and 17 on the year. A breakout season for her. But not only these numbers. You have to remember this girl was born to be a tennis champion, daughter of an ex-top 50 players, Maria has had this in her sights since she was a child. I feel she had a big leap when she practiced with Thomas Johansson, the Australian Open champion for a, for a whole year. But last year, in 2020, she had match points in the semifinals against Krichikova to go to the French Open final, but Krichikova, excuse me, eventually beat Pavluchenkova for the title. So Sakari was that close to already being a Grand Slam champion. I expect better things to come from this player. It's been a huge uptick for her, and she says that the most important part of her game is to be more kind to herself. She's being nicer to herself. So often you would see Maria Sakari in a, in a difficult situation in her match, and she just beat herself up, and that tore away her confidence. But now she knows not to do that. She's been working with a sports psychologist. She's always been fit, but she's gotten a better serve, a bigger forehand, just more penetrating and more aggressive, and that's made the difference.